What is going on, you guys? This is going to be episode four, I think. It could be five. I don't know. Of the free addresses that I've been giving out to help out you guys in the community. Um, all of these are proven addresses except one. Um, I haven't seen any returns from him, but my website that I use, Star Tiger, says that there's tons of uh, successes coming in. Um, I also want to know what do y'all think of the title of this series? I've been trying to think of some little catchy little title um, and in the YouTube community's Facebook group um, I asked what should I call it and someone said card cutter cutting out the middleman free TTM addresses and the reason we're cutting out the middleman is I'm cutting out all of those websites and books and all that stuff you have to pay for and just giving you the addresses straight up. Um, I don't necessarily, I'm not necessarily in love with the title, um, so if you can think of something more catchy, put it down below. So let's get into it. Um, another thing, one of these addresses I think I put in episode one, I'm not exactly sure. Um, I don't do a whole lot of research when I do these videos of what have I put in the past, so if you see duplicates, forgive me, okay? Um, but I try to come up with some cool stuff every episode. So first one is going to be Mike Erosioni, I believe it's pronounced. Actually, I know that's not how it's pronounced. Um, he was a captain of the 1980 U.S. hockey team, the Do You Believe in Miracles team, uh, Miracle on Ice, the, the Disney movie that was made. He was the captain. Um, really, really freaking cool. I haven't got him, but I actually have two cards in my eBay watch list right now um, to buy and to send to him. And by the time that I what's it called? Upload this video. I probably would have already gotten them back by now. So we'll see. Um, Scotty Bowman, uh, NF, excuse me, NHL, a hockey hall of fame coach. Freaking awesome. Um, this is a really cool one, but there's stipulations with this one. So Bob Euchre, um, he's the dude, he's the, uh, Milwaukee Brewers play by play guy. He's also the announcer that was in major league one and major league two. The guy that says you'd have to have, or he'd have to have a rocket up his ass to catch that one. Um, freaking awesome. And what was funny was as a kid, those were one of my favorite movies, Major League One and Two. And I didn't even know Bob Euchre was an actual, like, baseball dude. I just had no clue. I thought he was just from, like, Who's the Boss? That's the only place I knew him from. I think he was the dad in that show. Uh, You'll have to excuse me. I'm getting undressed while I'm talking. Um, so that's that. Bob Euchre, the stipulation with him is he doesn't sign anything that's a knockoff. He only, the only cards that he signs are tops, and they have to be manufactured from tops. And as far as baseballs, he'll sign baseballs, but they have to be official major league baseballs, the real deal. The 22, 25, whatever they are, dollar balls. Um, so that's that. He's another guy. I have two cards in my eBay watch list to send to him. I got him years ago, um, probably five or six years ago on a baseball. Um, so I want to roll the dice again. He's getting up there in age, um, but he would be an awesome freaking TTM success. This is the one I think I did in episode one. I could be wrong. Dick Vitale. Yeah, baby. Um, that dude, the NCAA play-by-play -play guy, he's actually, believe it or not, a basketball Hall of Famer. Um... So that's a cool one. This is the one that I said I haven't seen any successes from, but Star Tiger says that there's plenty of successes from him. The dude's name is Bailey Howe. He's an NBA Hall of Famer. Um, the only thing that I did some research on, I'll say that again, I did some research on. Yeah, anyways, so I did some research on, and it was $10 an item. From what I've seen, he's actually pretty stickler to that. So if you try to send him... 20 bucks and three or four or five items, he's going to sign two. If you send him $10 and you send two, he's only going to sign one. Um, so on and so forth. You can do the math. Um, next, dude, I'm like sending y'all or giving you guys all these addresses for guys that I'm trying to send off to like right now. Um, what's funny, I think I'll upload this video in August and today is the day before Father's Day, um, whenever that is. So, today's the day before Father's Day. Happy, extremely belated uh, Father's Day to all you freaking fathers out there. Um, so, hopefully, by the time I upload, all of these TTM successes will have come back on my end. 
And that's why I don't mind sharing these addresses. Um, but next is Brett Saberhagen. Um, to send to him, it is the Make a Difference Foundation. I've said this in past um, TTM address episodes. It is a foundation. So please don't take advantage of his generosity. Send a freaking donation. Don't be a freaking snob and send a dollar for five cards, okay? Send 10, 20 bucks and a couple cards. So that's Brett Saberhagen. I think he won a Cy Young or two back in the day. I could be wrong. I think it was like a Thursday or something that he won that. I don't know. <sighs> Moving on. Daryl Moose Johnston. Um, with the Cowboys fame back in the, what was that, early 90s when they were winning all those Super Bowls. Moose, as a lot of people know him. I think he's um, an announcer with Fox, I believe. Really fan favorite guy. Awesome freaking autograph. He always signs his his um, autograph really nice and loopy. And then he puts Moose right in the middle. Really awesome. Um, I got this uh, success back not too long ago. Jerry Kuzman. Jerry Kuzman is the other guy that's on the Nolan Ryan rookie card. So you know the Nolan Ryan rookie card is sideways. And there's Nolan Ryan and some other dude. That other dude is Jerry Kuzman. Um, he was actually a really good pitcher. Um, but in that rookie card, he gets overshadowed, uh, overshadowed by Mr. 7-No-Hitter from Alvin, Texas himself, Nolan Ryan. Um, and I see, looks like Jerry Kuzman charges $10, but it looks like you can get two autographs for 10 bucks. So that's a good deal. Moving on, Mike Vrabel. So back when the Patriots won their first, like, 35 Super Bowls back in the day, he was on those teams with Teddy Bruschi and all of those dudes. Um, so if you are if you collect like Super Bowl champs, guys that have won Super Bowls, he's a great one to get and a really good one to get. Um, it might be a seasonal address. He's currently the head coach for the Tennessee Titans. So right now, I think veteran mini camps are going on. When this video comes out, it'll probably be the beginning of preseason. So you could send now and you should get it back. The last one for this particular episode it's going to be a cool one. Um, it's one that I typically don't get myself, but I'm definitely trying to do some research and get it. And that is Tim Allen. Tim the Toolman Taylor from the Santa Claus movies, um, Buzz Lightyear's voice, the main dude on Home Improvement, the TV show from back in the day. That was one of my favorite TV shows as a kid. I watched it pretty religiously. Um, he's actually a really good TTM signer. And from what I've seen, he'll typically sign two, sometimes even three TTMs for people. So there you go. That's another 10... Ah, oh, dang, I guess I got a freaking... always recap it, but I can't recap it if I did this. Let's see here. <clears throat> so, that's another video with 10 free TTM addresses. So we'll go through it one more time. Mike Irizioni, um, no donation. Scotty Bowman. Another Hall of Famer, Bob Euchre, another Hall of Famer. I didn't say that. I don't think I said Bob Euchre's in the Hall of Fame. He's a Ford Frick winner, which if you're a Ford Frick winner in baseball, that puts you in the Hall of Fame. Um, Dick Vitale, yeah, baby. He's in the Basketball Hall of Fame. Fun fact, the NBA itself, the National Basketball Association, does not have a Hall of Fame. It is like the basketball. It's like the Naismith, I don't know, Hootie and the Blowfish Hall of Fame. It's like some weird name. Nave Smith something something. So that's that. Um, next is Bailey Howell. Um, he's an NBA Hall of Famer. He was inducted in 1997. Brett Saberhagen, once again, that's care of a foundation. So don't be a freaking money snob. Send a donation. Um, Daryl Johnson, that's a Super Bowl champion. Big time Cowboys fan favorite. Jerry Kuzman, he's the other dude on the left of Nolan Ryan on that rookie card. Also one hell of a pitcher. Mike Vrabel, fame with the, uh, actually he probably should be the most famous for being the, uh, what was he, like defensive coordinator for the Houston Texans. So screw the freaking in, the uh, Super Bowl champs and screw that he's the head coach now for the Titans. His main claim to fame was <laughs> that he was the defensive coordinator for the Houston Texans. And I'm just kidding because I'm a big Houston Texans fan. And last but not least, now I can do it, Tim the Toolman Taylor. So that is that. I hope you all enjoy it. One thing I've been trying to do, I'm, I'm hoping these particular videos 
get 500 plus views every time. Um, so we'll see. That's kind of my goal with this one. I normally don't have a goal when I put out a, a, a YouTube video. I just freaking roll with it and whatever I get, I get. That's it. Um, but this is kind of given back to y'all and I hope in return I get some views. If not, oh well. Um, drop a thumbs up if you want to keep these going. I'm starting to kind of like it. Um, it's something when I first started the first three, I wasn't a big fan of doing them. Um, but I'm kind of starting to enjoy it. It's, it's kind of fun. So that's that. Drop a thumbs up if you want to keep them going. Until next time, adios, be safe, bye-bye. Toodles.